Home is for me is a small town called Humpty about an hour and a half out of Darwin in the Northern Territory. I live on a property about 50k north of Winton. A home is Glen Morgan, not many people know where that is. Glen Morgan is about an hour south of Condamine, if you know where that is. So the closest town for me is Markadilla, which is about 40 k's west of Broma. My home is Chira Beach, and that's about 30 k's south of Beaker on the south coast of New South Wales. My last school before Toowoomba was to Min College in Humpty Doo. I did primary school at a school called Longridge uh, Distance Education. It's not a proper school, like I'd be taught at home by mum in the kitchen or something. Uh, my last school was a place called Surat with Surat State School with um, about 80 kids. Um, so before TGS I actually used to live at Mooney, which, and then I went to school in a Dolby State School. My last school was Lennon Christie Catholic College. Uh, the school that I went to before TGS was St George State School. Um, my parents sent me to TGS because um, my granddad used to go here when he was my age and it's sort of just a family sort of thing. My um, parents sent me to TGS because of the academic opportunities, um, as well as that I would used to have to catch the bus into Roma, which would take about an hour off each way. My parents sent me, sent me to TGS because they wanted me to like get a better education and get more sporting opportunities. I travel on a bus to Brisbane, then a four and a half hour flight to Darwin, and then an hour drive to home. Um, when I come home from school, I have to go on a bus. I live in Bus Queensland, and it takes about 18 hours. Um, I get a couple of meal stops, so that's all good. All good. Um, usually, either if my parents don't come up, I usually have to catch the bus home, which is about six hours. Uh, travel home to be able to. A 20 hour drive, uh, or I can do a 6 hour drive to Sydney, plus a plane flight to Brisbane and then to Toowoomba. When I'm home I like to do a lot of fishing with my friends, mainly barrack fishing. Um, I get to Ride bikes, help dad out when I'm at home uh, on the holidays, so that's pretty good. Um, I mostly ride my bikes. Um, I've every Wednesday and Friday I have to go get on my bike and ride down and get the mail. Um, at home, probably just waking up when the sun gets up and sort of be back at about dinner. Also, yeah, just helping dad around at the farm, doing stuff that he needs and. If I'm not a dad, I'm next door helping them out. Um, probably the thing I miss out on most when I'm at home is probably phone reception. Like, I'll have to climb on the roof to get three hours, otherwise there's not much at all. Um, yeah, at home, probably the most I miss out on is probably, yeah, sport. There's not heaps out there. The hardest thing for me was getting around the school. The hardest thing I found starting at TGS was probably homesickness. Um, once I got used to it, it was all good. Just finding new friends. Uh, the hardest thing about starting was being being a boy with me was missing my pets because we don't get to see them for 10 weeks. The hardest thing about starting as a board for me was getting to know all different mates from everywhere across the world. Um, something boarding's taught me is that like you gotta 
uh, except like everyone has different personalities and you can't really get up someone for not being the same as you and like you've got to get along with everyone. Uh, boarding has taught me uh, independence to um, look after myself a bit more. Um, yeah, just hand your phone knife at him, don't get distracted by girls, really. Boarding's taught me independence and getting to know a lot of people that are a lot different to what I am. Funniest thing that's happened in boarding to me probably be getting pizza put in my bed on a Saturday night. Oh, the funniest thing that ever happened was probably last year we were playing indoor cricket when we probably actually weren't supposed to and we smashed a window. Um, the best things about being a boarder are probably just the mates that you, that you meet and the great people you come across. Um, to touch footy on the weekends, it's really good. Um, best thing about being a boarder, just you feel free and you feel like, because I have two sisters and no brothers, you feel like you're living with your own brothers. The best things about boarding at TGS are just being with your mates all the time. You can just go out, kick the footy, have a good time, have a laugh, joke around. The best thing about being a boarder is probably the, the connection you get with the school and the pride you have in it. Best things about being a boarder, waking up every day next to your mates in the dorm, seeing them all the time. Best thing for me about being a boarder is getting to know mates and people from all across the world to just know everything and anything that I don't.